this is Sabina. Welcome to another sit down video, guys. Today we got a mini haul. I'm just going to try to bring you guys whatever finds I have so we can be consistent with the videos. Um, I got a small mini thrift store haul. I went to the thrift store today, guys. Honestly, I couldn't find anything much. So I just got what I thought was ready then. I'm trying to not be buying unnecessarily. I just want to bring you guys good finds. To all of my new subscribers or to anybody that is walking by, I just went straight into the video. My name is Sabina. Here on YouTube, we are Pad Beauty. What we do on this channel is we go looking for back in prices, come and start them to our own unique uh, um, stars. We are Bucci on the budget. We make cheap look fabulous. This is where guys, we believe in not breaking the budget. We just spend what we can afford. I hope you find this content interesting enough that will make you want to hit the subscribe button. Join the family and let's have fun guys. Let's do this. So like I said, I got a mini haul. I got only two items from the um, and thrift store. This is Second Avenue thrift store in the Maryland area. If you hear, there is two that I know of. One is in Laurel, Maryland and one is in Columbia. I am usually blessed to find good um stuff at the Columbia one so that's what I go but Laura too do have um good stuff I just feel like they're overpriced they are overpriced but I think Laura is just too much I'm sorry guys um just something way too honest um yeah but yeah guys we're just gonna go right into the haul first we're gonna start with some small um tricks here I find guys I always tell you guys me and TJ Maxx have a love connection it's, the only problem here is me that have that love connection with them. They don't have the love connection with me. But hopefully one day we can, the feelings can be mutual. Um, but yeah, I went by TJ Maxx today. I was just looking through to see if there was anything new. Nothing new. I just got this recycled paper that I think I'm going to be dropping down notes for my videos and other stuff um it's a recycled paper so that's what made me to pick it up at least we are recycling yeah and it was $2.99 next up guys at TJ Maxx I pick up this Apple Watch scrap um it's three in a pack it have two genuine leather and one silicone mine is kind of like fading out now because i think i have my watch for like over a year or so now so it's kind of filling up and i was glad to find this like three and it was 19.99 and oh i don't even know what this one is probably somewhere here i got this one from in delaware um i work in delaware now so there's one that is just like four minutes from job. So I just drove by there to see if they have something to that I could buy to make a video. Nothing much, but I saw this coach ring. And it was a whole set, but I just opted to get the ring. Um, yeah, this little hat ring. And it was $16.99. Guys, you should check these local stores right now. They have a lot of things in the store. A lot of gift ideas that you can use to buy gift for people. Um, yeah, so if you're a TJ Maxx lover, go there, check it out, and see. I also got this uh, hoop earring, guys. You guys know I don't wear a lot of hoops. As you can see, I love stalled earring. But every now and then, I would get me one if I think it's kind of a unique piece. This looks like a unique piece. So I got it, um, it by Robert Lee Morris. It was $10, so I picked it up. I went back today, I saw the bracelet of this, but I was not in the mood of um, shopping, so yeah. Uh, next up, it's just a mini haul, guys. It's not too much. It's this bracelet. This kind of reminded me of one of those um, 
I don't know which brand, but it has like those woman numbers on there. This is what it reminded me of. That's what I pick it up. Um, but this one is more of a star and heart and diamond and butterflies. It was for $19.99. So I just grabbed this piece. If you put it on, this is how it look like. So yes, guys, my favorite color is gold. If you don't know by now, I love gold jewelry. I just feel it make you look rich. Uh, last but not the least for my TJ Maxx haul is this uh, scent. Got another perfume. It's a Versace, Versace red jeans. I don't know if I have bought this or if I have tried this. I'm not sure, but like in this little mini bottle i bought another one from ross but i'm going to take that because i thought it was an eyeshadow palette but when i came it's perfume and like 19.99 like nope it's going back mm. this smells so nice and feminine now i'm thinking about it i might have one of these no i don't think i have it Oh God, it smells so feminine. Mm. Yep, it smells so. It smells so good. Mm. I love it. It's like this light champagne um, kind of scent. All right, guys. So that's that for my TJ Maxx, and we just for I have one sunglasses that I got from DHK. I'm gonna show you guys and this is how it came came in a box it came with a dust bag this was really affordable this was for $25 and yeah this is so cute it's kind of like in the shape of a hot um hot light um cat eye sorry cat eye um shape and it's all dark really beautiful beautiful glasses guys i told you guys glasses is my signature piece i don't leave my house i don't care whether it's winter only at night i don't worry but i always have some glasses somewhere uh, in my pack it came all squished up guys so this thing is not closing like it's supposed to because it came like really really beat up but yeah that was part of it all right guys for the last two items in this haul i got a bag yes guys <laughs> like i don't have space for a bag guys to be honest with you guys i i ran out of space um three rooms all filled so buying bags now i don't know um but yeah this nice Italian is by, I think they call this uh, Tukeni or Tuseni. It's T U S C A N Y, letter made in Italy. So this is made, made in like, I don't know, France or whatever, Italy. And I heard those are the same place that Chanel, Gucci, um, Louis Vuitton made their brands. Uh, this is, I believe it's still brand new. It had this tag on it, but it don't have the original tag. This stuff is still here. Handcrafted. I just love the design in this bag, if you can see. And what drew me to it, it looked like the Givenchy. I think it's an Antikiko, which is one bag I really, really want. I'm ironing that bag, but it's still almost in a thousand. I'm hoping I can be blessed one day to find it in like six or seven hundred dollars. I will pick it up. That's my dream bag, one of my dream bags. But here, yeah, this bag was for uh, $99.99. I had a discount, so I think I pay like $89 for this. So, yeah. All leather, handmade, handcrafted beautiful bag 
I don't know if I'm going to keep it. This is going to be probably listed on my um, Poshmark. Like I said, guys, I don't have no space for bags anymore. Next, at the thrift store, I found this off-white. I don't know if it's off-white, but it just say off, O-F-F, -F, dress. And uh, brand new. I pick it up. It is this dress. And I believe this is going on my Poshmark too. So if you like this, you can go check it up on Poshmark. So this is how it look like. You know what, guys? Hold on. Let me try this dress on for you guys. It's kind of cute. Um, yeah. It didn't have the price tag on it, but I did look it up and in, I think it's Nima's Market markers i saw this dress and it was going for like 600 and change on sale but it was in the thrift store for 89.99 10 percent off so 79.99 i believe i'm going to be listing this dress i don't know but we will see but yes guys that's all i have for you in this mini haul i hope you guys are having a wonderful and Fabulous Sunday, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, loves. Yay!